You're going to die, so make sure that you live the best life you can live. That's definitely what I've been telling myself while I'm here in Vilnius in Lithuania, in the Baltics. Uh, it's a beautiful view here. Um, so much history in this city and in this country. Uh, I was amazed to learn earlier that um, you know, the Nazis uh, occupied this region uh, in World War II and then the Soviets came in and occupied it and the KGB set up here and I'm about to actually go to the former KGB headquarters in that building over there and check it out. Um, and uh, these Lithuanians, you know, have been occupied for, you know, we've occupied most of the, of the last century and only now have they, or recently since uh, 1991 with the fall of the Soviet Union, were they able to declare independence uh, again. And it's making me realize just how uh, you know, how much for granted I take my own freedom and my own life and, you know, I grew up in uh, Australia obviously where everything's seemingly safe and we've never really been invaded with Japanese bombers in Darwin like one day in World War II, well, that was about it. Um, I grew up in a pretty, you know, free lifestyle if you like. And I take it for granted. And then you come here and you just learn the history about you know countries like this, and you uh, you see photos of uh, people being led out to extermination camps, and the Nazis came in and they took all of the uh, Lithuanian Jews out um, outside of town and just performed this mass genocide. And it makes you just realize, wow, man how lucky have I had it and how lucky do we have it in today's modern world. As I'm recording this it's now 2016, we just, you know, the world at the moment is pretty safe, generally speaking. We don't have uh, the fear of mass extermination looming over our heads, we don't really have the fear of countries invading us. Sometimes we might feel that depending on, you know, the current state of world politics, but for the most part, certainly in my life, everything's been pretty okay uh, and then you come to this place and you learn the history and you just go wow life is short people have endured such hardship um, you really got to make life like just live it the best best you can because you never know when something's gonna happen and it's just gonna be taken from you or someone's gonna be taken from you so you're going to die <laughs> and when you sort of like say that to yourself as dark as that sounds uh, it kind of, you kind of realize, it kind of inspires you to just travel, do what you want to do, hang out with who you want to hang out with. If you want to write a book, then write a book. If you want to start a business, start a business. If you want a certain type of romantic partner, then make it happen. Get that certain type of romantic partner. Choose how you want to live your life. Because as the history of this great country will tell us, there are times when people come in, when they invade you, and they either kill you or they force their way of life on you. Of course, that's the way of, of the world in many cases. Even Australia, where I grew up from, you know, the English came in and settled it in the late, in late 1700s, and we kind of, you know, killed out the Aborigines there. So it's not like I'm coming from a, I'm so innocent. You know, my ancestors were so innocent either. Sometimes. But whatever your politics, whatever your worldview, it still doesn't change the fact that we have to just live the best life we can now. So for me, I love to travel. That's why I'm here. I'm traveling. Uh, I went to Helsinki for a work event and then I looked at the map and I saw Tallinn. a pretty magical place so life is short live life the best way that you can let me just grab my scarf here I'm gonna leave you with this last view so what do you want to do what's on your bucket list 
Leave a comment down below now and tell me. I read every comment. Let me know what you want to do, what you're going to do, because life is short and you're going to die. I hope you get the positive message out of that dark statement that you're going to die. All right, for, so from Vilnius in Lithuania, leave a comment down below right now and share this video. Share it with someone who you think might be inspired by the message.